guys, Ben here, and you watch a video by Urchin Greaser. Today I'm going to be doing a hair product review, which is going to be Murray Superior Hairdressing Pomade. Um, I got that for Christmas, hence from that Christmas vlog that you may have like, seen. Um, the packaging uh, is basically like Dax, but however though, comparing to like Murray's and Dax, uh, there is like similarities to that. Like with this, um, it's really like tough. Because um, with like Dax, it's easy to rub in, but when it comes to like uh, Murray Superior, it's basically doing the like really, 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 really quick like, until like your hands are warm and stuff. Because um, it is actually like a bitch to apply in your hair if you don't like rub it like super quick and all of that. Especially you get like lumps like your scalp and stuff. And believe me, it's absolutely annoying. And of course, like with um, Dax. Uh, it's like a cheaper version of uh, Murray's, like personally. Some have suggested I should try like uh, Murray's um, light pomade. It's, I think it's called that. I don't know. Murray's super light. I think it's called. I don't know what it's fucking called. So um, yeah, uh, that's what it looks like inside. And then um, the smell. It's kind of like a. Uh, I don't know, I don't know how to describe that. Um, smells like shoe polish in my opinion. It's, it's a simple way to kind of like describe it. I don't know. But for the people who have like Murray's and they have their like personal opinion about the smell and all that, it's all down to you guys. Um, and the thing like with uh, the people that Afro there, um, it was actually originally like used like for African Americans like with their... Um, Afros and whatnot, and then we started uh, like rocking it like with our pompadours and stuff like that. And something to address about, and uh, everyone tends to like panic about it. Uh, majority of people say that uh, it's making them go bald and whatnot. Uh, not quite literally, because uh, majority of people have been saying that it makes their hair like go thin and stuff like that. Uh, it doesn't necessarily mean you're gonna go bald and stuff like that. I mean, yeah. You do get so much strands of hair, like in your hair comb and whatnot, but it's absolutely like normal with like hair strands and all that. Like you know when you like wash your hair, like in your bath and whatnot, and you see like strands of hair like coming out. It's kind of like that, really. Uh, there's no like difference. And of course, um, if you don't really feel comfortable with it with your hair and whatnot, um, just simply don't use it. Or what you could do though, you could like put brill cream in it as well. I mean. Yeah, I know that Brill Cream literally like eats like the wax and stuff like that because our like, Brill Cream isn't like a pomade. So what you could do instead, you can mix that with uh, like Royal Crown hairdressing. That is a good combination for that. And uh, most people use Brill Cream. Um, it really depends to be fair with you, man. But as I've got curly hair, uh, that's pretty much done its justice for me like with the side part, zero phase uh, pompadour. And I will be doing a hair like tutorial like for that and um, for doing like an Elvis Presley like hairstyle um, you could give it a go but where it's like a heavy hair product um, you might not get like the effect because uh, with Elvis Presley um, he used stuff like a uh, Royal Crown and that one's heavier because with like Royal Crown hairdress and Royal Crown pomade it's like a, a light light product it's a simple way to describe it like to be frank with you. But over and all though, uh, if you're looking for a hair product for like a decent like pompadour and whatnot, I would absolutely recommend that. And uh, again, don't worry about the whole like hair strand like, scenario. Uh, if you end up going bald, then you're obviously like destined like for it. That's just a simple way to describe it. So don't worry about it guys. And uh, again, if you don't feel comfortable about it, then just simply don't use it. That's all there is to it. So I'm going to finish the video from there guys and um, you'll take care and I'll see you in the next video. Bye now.